hello guys welcome back to my channel thank you very much for staying tuned and keep coming back and um, for those who ask me why my computer is having uh, so low temperatures when i'm uh, playing i'm dedicating this video to you and also for the ones who didn't ask me this i'm doing it because it's useful <laughs> so i'm going to show you today how to configure your gpu and your cpu uh, for having best performance during your gaming session so let's start okay so for the installation of the msi after burning during the setup don't forget to install both components I will leave some useful links uh, in the description so you can use it later. Open it, change the skin for an easier look, go to settings, then user interface, uh, user interface skinning properties, and then default MSI after burning, a V2 skin, then OK. And now for the display, go to settings, monitoring, GPU temperature, then show the on-screen display uh, you can do the same for the U uh, gpu usage and select the frame rate if you want you can monitor other information as desired then go to control plus f to see the voltage uh, slash frequency curve editor uh, here is where the magic begins you can see that my gpu frequency starts about a um, 1300 and goes up to 1900 megahertz which i think is overkill and puts on fire my gpus so for fixing this we can change the minimum and maximum frequency of the processor you should never go above 1900 megahertz because you can kill your processor that's very dangerous this is my current settings and i found them awesome uh, without killing the fps you can see the original setting and this is my current voltage frequency curve you can change every dot individually as your desired setting or you can copy my settings my gpu frequency starts uh, in about uh, 1400 and goes up to 1600 MHz. these give me awesome temperatures around 70 degrees that is um, what i have to tell you for the gpu for the cpu you can do two things First, you can undervolt the CPU with the software um, Intel Extreme Tuning Utility, but I think it only works on CPUs that are unlocked, like my i7 10750H. In order to this software uh, work, you have to change one setting in the BIOS uh, in the advanced mode, uh, right shift, right control, left alt, and F2. Then go to advanced, Again, uh, overclocking performance menu, enable the overclocking feature and enable the XTU interface. Save and exit. In the Intel Extreme uh, Toning Utility, uh, go to Advanced Toning, then I agree, then Core Voltage Offset, then set it to minus 0.1 uh, volts, then click Apply and Close, and it should be running in the background. And now the best thing that is working like magic, uh, right click on your battery icon, then power options, then go to on balance click, then change plan settings, after that change advanced power settings, go to look for processor power management, then maximum processor state, and set it as you like. You can play with this as much as you can, and you can define uh, what works for you the best. Mine, as you can see, is 97% on plug-in and it will reduce your CPU temperature and it will not affect the performance. Trust me. Hit an OK and save changes and we Gucci. Okay, so if you follow all the instructions and did as I said, <laughs> you will be no longer having problems with the temperature when you are gaming and your computer will be running great. So I hope you liked the video and it's useful for you. Thank you again for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to give me some likes. And if you want to see something else about the MSI related with the performance and anything else, uh, please leave me a comment. I will read it all. And that will be it with me. Thank you for watching and giving you a kiss.